Hello friends, I am here again with a new lesson for the students of class 9th. My today's topic is the play, If I Were You. This play is written by Douglas James. Before reading the play, let's have a look on the basics of a play. A play is a literary form of writing for theatre which narrates a story with elements of conflict, tensions and actions through dialogues of characters. It is divided into acts and scenes. Now let's highlight the elements of a play. First element of a play is plot. Plot means order of the events that occur in the play. Second point is characters. Characters means the persons who play their roles in a play. Third one is dialogue. Dialogue means conversation or interaction between the characters. And fourth point is setting. What do you mean by setting? Setting means time and place where a story is set. And fifth element is conflict. Conflict means it refers to the challenge man characters need to solve. The sixth point or the sixth element is resolution. Resolution means the solution to a complex issue and a story. There are five main types of plays. Let's discuss these types one by one. First one is tragedy. These plays end on a tragic note. Tragedy ek aisa play hota hai jis mein aam toh se jo events hote hain wo sad hote hain. Jo audience hote hain wo ek dukh mehsus karte hain. Jo tragedy hoti hai wo tragic hero ke saath hoti hai. अगर एक विलन के साथ कोई ट्रेजेडी पेश आती है दैट प्ले कॉन्ट बी कंसिडर्ड एज ए ट्रेजेडी क्योंकि जो विलन होता है उसके लिए जरूरी होता है सफर करना बट वेन द हीरो और द प्रोटेगोनेस्ट ऑफ द प्ले सफर दैट प्ले कैन बी कॉल्ड एज ए ट्रेजेडी डॉक्टर फॉस्टिस रिटर्न बाय क्रिस्टोफर मॉलो इज द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए ट्रेजिडी और भी बहुत सारे प्लेज ही फॉर एग्जाम्पल किंग लेयर इज ए ट्रेजिडी और वी कैन से दैट दिस हेमलेट रिटर्न बाई विलियम शेक्सपियर इज ए ट्रेजिडी जूलियस सीजर ओथेलियो दीज आर ऑल ट्रेजिडीज नेक्स्ट काइंड ऑफ प्ले इज कॉमेडी दीज प्लेज और meant to amuse the audiences. ये इन प्लेस का मकसद होता है ऑडियंस को हंसाना इन प्लेस में जो ह्यूमरस एलिमेंट्स होते हैं वो काफी ज्यादा होते हैं ए मिड समर नाइट ड्रीम रिटर्न बाय विलियम शेक्सपियर इज द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए कॉमेडी हियर इज अनदर दिस काइंड ऑफ प्ले इट्स ट्रेजी कॉमेडी ट्रेजिडी ट्रेजी कॉमेडी इज अ मिक्सचर ऑफ ट्रेजिडी एंड कॉमेडी ये वो प्ले होता है जिसमें सैड इवेंट्स भी हों और इसमें अम्यूजमेंट भी हो द मर्चेंट ऑफ फेंस रिटर्न बाय विलियम शेक्सपियर कैन बी कॉल्ड एज द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए ट्रेजी कॉमेडी फोर्थ वन इज melodrama this type of play has exaggerated characters and 
episodes with songs and music for an emotion emotive appeal to the audience yani ki ye play jo hota hai melodrama ये प्ले ऐसा होता है जिसमें एग्जेगरेटेड कैरेक्टर्स होते हैं ऐसे कैरेक्टर्स होते हैं दैट सेम टू बी अनरियल जो अनरियल कैरेक्टर्स मतलब दिखाई दे और ये करेक्ट इस प्ले में म्यूजिक और सॉन्ग्स भी होते हैं इस जो सिकल लाइफ ब्रीफ एनकाउंटर रिटर्न बाय न्योल कावर्ड कैन बी द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ है melodrama fifth kind of play is domestic play these plays are based on the normal life of family and friends let's read the play if i were you dear students do you find anything strange in the title if i were you yes there is a strange thing i wear we know that we always use singular verb was after i can we use plural verb where of i yes we can dear students this is called subjunctive mode this is called subjunctive mode and is used when you are talking about something that isn't true or when you wish something was true for example if i were rich what does it mean i am not rich i just imagine you can use i were if you imagine something or if something is not true and you want to be like that for example if i were a bird it's not true i'm not a bird but i wish to be a bird now let's try to justify the title of the play dear students the story of the play revolves around the intruders we shaint plan to take gerard's identity by killing him the title conveys the sense of an unfulfilled wish of the intruder therefore it is perfectly an apt title now let's talk about the characters of the play there are two main characters in the play first one is gerard gerard is a playwright in the play he lives in a small cottage in a lonely place he can be well termed as the protagonist of the play protagonist means hero of the play and there is another character that is intruder what do you mean by intruder his name is not mentioned in the play he is just named as intruder intruder means someone who intrudes on the privacy or property of another person without permission or we can say that bin bulaye aane wala yani ki wo shakhs जो किसी मकान में किसी की प्रॉपर्टी में बिन बुलाए दाखिल हो जाए इजाजत के बगैर देर इज एन अदर बैक स्क्रीन कैरेक्टर यानी कि एक ऐसा कैरेक्टर भी इस प्ले में है जो कि बैक स्क्रीन है जो स्क्रीन पे नहीं आता है आई मीन दिस सॉर्जेंट डेयर स्टूडेंट्स The play is set in a small cottage situated in a lonely place. The cottage has two doors. The furniture in the cottage 
is simple. There is also a telephone in the cottage. In this play, Gerard lives alone in a lonely cottage. An intruder who is a criminal enters his cottage. He intends to murder Gerard and take on his identity. Does he succeed? इस प्ले में जेराड एक तन्हा जगह पे एक कॉटेज में रहता है एक इंट्रूडर यानी कि एक बिन बुलाए शख्स जो कि एक क्रिमिनल होता है एक मुजरिम होता है इंटर्स वो कॉटेज में दाखिल होता है ही इंटेंड्स उसका इरादा होता है टू मर्डर जेराड कि वो जेराड को कत्ल करे एंड टेक ऑन हिज आइडेंटिटी और उसकी आइडेंटिटी उसकी पहचान हासिल करे डज ही सक्सीड दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन फॉर अस डज ही सक्सीड क्या वो कामयाब होता है लेट्स रीड द स्टोरी ऑफ द प्ले एंड फाइंड आउट द आंसर जेरॉड वेल टेल हिम टू फोन अप डार्कली आई मस्ट नो येस आई एक्सपेक्ट आई विल स्टल बे हेयर but you must not count on that in about 10 minutes time right ho goodbye he puts down the phone and goes to the divan on the right on the left where there is a traveling bag and starts packing while as he is thus engaged another man similar in build to gerard enters from the right silently revolver in hand he is flashly dressed in a in an overcoat and a soft hat he bumps accidentally against the table and at sound gerard turns quickly gerard after a conversation on phone with someone leaves the receiver and stand starts packing an intruder enters in hurry and collides with the table gerard turns in surprise gerard pleasantly why this is a surprise mr intruder i am glad you are pleased to see me i don't think you will be pleased for long put those pass up Gerard turns in surprise he tells the intruder that he is pleased to see him the intruder replies that he will not be pleased for long he orders Gerard to up his hands Gerard this is all very melodramatic not very original perhaps but intruder trying to be calm and air gerard non challenge is your word i think intruder thanks a lot you will soon stop being somewhat i will make you crawl i want to know a few things see gerard tells him his actions are not real he behaves like a melodramatic hero the intruder warns him to be calm and quiet then the intruder tells gerard that he will down him and make him stop for being smart he further tells him that he wants to know a few things about him gerard anything you like i know all the answers but before we begin i should like to change my position you may be comfortable but i am not intruder sit down there and no funny business motions to a chair and seats himself on the divan by the bag now then we will have a nice little talk about yourself 
Jero tells him that he wa he knows everything, but he feels uncomfortable in that position. On this, the intruder allows him to sit on a chair and seats himself on the divan near the bag. This is enough for today. I will come back with second part of this lesson. So stay home, stay safe.